Young children are being given a great opportunity to learn about their community, and it's through the voices of their seniors, as the Early Childhood Community Development Centre launches a local intergenerational program to bring seniors and children together. It's a pilot project between uh, three local licensed childcare programs, uh, Lookout Ridge, Fort Erie Regional, and Niagara Nursery School, and three local seniors residences, Gilmore Lodge, Lookout Ridge, and uh, Chartwell, Niagara. And the idea is to bring together preschool children with seniors to engage in meaningful activities with one another. The goal is to make sure that young children and seniors are engaged and connected to their community. And the project found that one of the best ways to accomplish this is through sensory activity. We've included a lot of gardening, um, planting, um, or baking activities, and also activities that are musical. In terms of the uh, preschoolers and seniors' um, attention span, that they, they both um, are looking for um, quick activities and activities that are really stimulating, but they don't necessarily um, keep their attention for a long length of time. So we kept the visits very short and interactive and fun. Vera, tell me what you did today. Well, we planted the, uh, the flat plants today. Well, we did the ivy and their uh, plants that grow up and she watered them. So Vera, what do you enjoy about having the kids coming? Well, it's something different than being in the room all the, the time. People, the people. You get out and you get uh, moving around and it's, it's really quite different. And to have that music that that man played today was really something. <laughs> and the kids enjoyed that sitting all in the middle. It's been really wonderful to see the relationships. A lot of them don't have the extended family anymore, whether they've moved away or they're from another country. And so it's been nice to have that connection. And we've seen a lot of the children, even after the visits, they'll ask, who's my grandma? And we have to tell them who their grandma's name is and so that they can come and see again. Um, when we were walking over here today, they were all excited to come and have a tea party with them. And it's just been a nice extension to our program. I think it's really great for children and seniors to be mixed together, to be able to have, you know, good quality time, kind of learning from each other, having a little bit of fun and definitely, you know, sharing stories and just having a really great time together. And do you plan on keeping this program going? That is exactly what we're hoping to do. We've actually set up a relationship now where we will keep this going on a monthly basis. So the second Wednesday of every month at 10.30, we will have the children come over from the Fort Erie Child Care Centre and we'll be able to do that intergenerational program for hopefully years to come. Through the pilot, we have developed um, a toolkit for um, the visits. It includes a preschooler backpack and a senior's information pack and a strategies handbook. And that uh, toolkit, intergenerational program toolkit, will be distributed to licensed childcare programs across Niagara in the hopes that um, they will also choose to develop intergenerational programs and they'll have the tools to do that really easily. So far, the goals of the intergenerational project have been reached, and the next step is to bring the program to the rest of the Niagara region. In Fort Erie, reporting for The Source, I'm Carolyn LeConte.